I don't know if I can finish this race. I really got to take a dump. See what happens though. I'm kind of on rails right now. Take out the TM. Get out of here. Why are you riding that piece of fly by this dude? Oh, Caroli's out front. Okay. We got to get this Italian bastard. Oh, how low I just stayed there. Holy sh... Oh my god. Simpson just ate it. What's going on everybody? And in today's video, we're back on MXGP3. I haven't played this game in a few months, but... Coming back and playing it, I had a few requests to come back, and uh, this is still my favorite milestone motocross game that's been released. MXGP 2021, I like it, but it doesn't come close to MXGP 3, in my opinion. We're going to go over to the Monster Energy MX of Nations, which for some reason hasn't been brought back in any other games since this one. Maggiore Italy is one of the best tracks in the game, but you can only ride it on Motocross of Nations, so we'll do a race on it. Alright, so I haven't done any practice races. So I'm coming in into this pretty rusty, I bet. We're going to give them like a 10 second head start or something like that. Riding is Kevin Benoit. Oh, the bike sounds are so good in this game. They kind of brought them back in Supercross 6, but they still sound better in MXGP3. Five laps, that's plenty of time. We'll give them 15 seconds. Listen to that sound. All right, let's go. Oh, I can't wait to start reeling ruts in this game, man. I don't have my glasses on. I can't really see shit. The only thing that's going to be weird about playing MXGP3 is the fact that there's no, like, free whips or anything like that. It's kind of... Um... What's the word I'm looking for? Heavy? I remember the AI being decent in this game. So we should have a good brace here. I like the whips. They're not spectacular, but they get the job done. I'm kind of riding like a donkey right now. I am going to watch the swearing because the video will get demonetized, so... I'll probably end up screaming instead of swearing this video. Hooking into that. You hook into the tiniest routes in this game. I love it. What's another rev limiter? Oh, that sounds so nice. We still have, we're barely catching the back of the pack here, so the AI is pretty rapid. Somebody just ate it. Oh, this game feels so good already, man. Oh shit! I don't know how I didn't die there. It's got a bit of a heavy feeling in the corners, but it's so satisfying, man. The terrain deformation, the sounds. The handling does feel nice. The whips aren't too bad. Scrubs. Let's see if you can uh, take out the AI. Let's see what happens here. Alright. You can actually move them out of the way. Not bad. Oh, I messed up. I screwed the pooch. God damn it, I want to swear, man. It's so stupid. I had a big-ass poutine few minutes ago and I have to take the biggest dump in the world my god I might have to I don't know if I can finish this race I really got to take a dump see what happens though. I'm kind of on rails right now take out the TM get out of here while you're riding that piece of piece of shit I'm kind of flying right now about to pass my teammate here show him off and buy it show him the business oh you dick they're on a 250, get here. I still don't know why they haven't brought back MX of Nations. It was a nice feature to this game. Sucks that they uh, took it out, never to return. Oh, ho, ho. I just wheeled it all the way up that hill. We're gonna rail the outside. God, this game feels so good, man. I, I would pay $80 for this game over again. It's that good. Push Brian Bogus out of the way. This guy was my rival in this game. He would always take me out for whatever reason. Never forget. That was first person. Not too bad, actually. Not a bad angle. It kind of follows the way your guy's looking in the corners. Coming up on Anstey here. He's on a Husqvarna 250. That shows you how old this game is. I think it's like at least six years old by this point. 
That Cooper Webb is on a friggin' Yamaha. We're only in seventh, so this might not be that as easy as I thought it was gonna be. Good thing I put it on five laps. I haven't even crashed yet. Flying by Webb here. Canada's a better country, get out of here. Webb trying to come back on me there. We're not gonna let that happen. I really wish they would remaster this game or make another game similar to this because after MXGP3 they kind of lost the plot a bit with the physics. Every game after this became very slippery. Shit. Get on the track. Oh my god. There's the first mistake. Like you just hook into everything. It's awesome. See this? Boom. Railed it. They're kind of hard to see. But you fly through them. Okay, well, I think we got a chance for the win here. It's going to be a pretty close battle, actually. Oh, that was clean. Oh, yeah, this is the track where Anderson got landed on. I forgot about that shit. Fly by this dude. Oh, Caroli's out front. Okay. We got to get this Italian bastard. Oh my god, it's giving me the business. Todd Waters ain't messing around. Ray on the outside here. Up the inside. Nice, move done, job done. I'm having so much fun right now. This game is so good. My favorite milestone game to date. Oh, crap. Caroli's coming. Uh oh, I'm choking. I'm choking. No. Oh, he's scrubbing it too. <laughs> he's on my asshole, man. That was a sick race. All right, so this time we're riding as Romain Fevre on the Yamaha. That's how old this game is. And um, we're on Spain, awesome track, and we're going to give them about 10 to 12, 15 seconds again. Oh, the bike backfires. That sounds nice. There is a nice big line here. Let's see if I can hit it. It's not that hard, but we got it. I wish they would come back to this track, because this was one of my favorites on all the older MXGP games. Oh, ho, ho. How low I just stayed there, holy shit. Got all these ruts here, man. Oh, I missed, I went too fast. All right, we're catching the back of the pack, so we're doing better so far. Oh my god, Simpson just ate it. One thing about this game, if you notice it, the tires move so slow. I had to point that out. We're already up to third, uh, 11th here, so. I think we should easily win this. Let's take the inside this time. Pretty simple track. Oh my god. You can stay so low. That dude ate it. Oh my god. The hay bales are like a thousand pounds though, so you don't want to hit them. Went too fast again through there. Oh. He just tried to take me out. Holy, we're flying. We're already in third, so we're, we're looking good here. That's how you know a game's good when you can come back months after not playing it. And just get right back into the flow, man. I wish there was an option for four laps, because five might be a bit too long. I love scrubbing these, oh my god. Can never get enough of these bike sounds. They're, they're the best that we've ever had. I keep Matt's not that corner. So now we're in the lead and we still got about 
a lap or two to go, so we're sitting pretty. Final lap. Let's see if we can get a quick lap time in or something. Oh, never, there goes that. Never mind. After playing Legends so much lately, you come back to a game like this where the bike sounds are really good. Makes you hate the, the bike sounds in Legends even more. If that game can get some decent bike sounds, oh. Like, imagine if Legends had MXGP3's bike sounds. That would be incredible. That'd be a masterpiece. We destroyed everybody that race. So that's uh, MXGP3. It's still one of my favorite games to ever be made. Um, it holds up to this day, even though it's getting old at this point. But uh, if you want to see more videos on it, let me know. And uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And take care.